We saw some wonderful presentations today. Uh, of course, that central theme was all about brands and the value, and importantly, how we can leverage brands to take advantage of the opportunities ahead, uh, and indeed how to address some of the challenges. We tried very hard to reflect the entire Australian economy, from heavy industry with Horizon, to brands rebuilding themselves like Kodak, to Jenea, who show that Australia is leading the world in IVF and research, and to CCH, Walters Kluwer, who are rebranding. I'm really pleased, and we've had such good feedback from the audience, and the questioning was particularly exciting, and we didn't have any dull moments at all. So, right across the board, as we've always known, brand is strong, but even in every individual vertical we saw today, it still allows it to maintain or grow premium regardless of market forces, locally or globally. Interesting opportunity to get different cross-sections and a variety of speakers from different industries sharing their experience. Uh, what I liked were the frameworks which they shared and some of the practical issues that they faced. And I particularly liked the exchange of questions and the sharing that took place. It was uh, the coming together of different uh, people from various uh, brands and walks of life. So it was a very balanced perspective on uh, what does it take for brands to be global and what does it take for global brands to be competitive in Australia. And I think that's that was something that was very interesting about it. A lesson that everybody could receive today is the fact that uh, there was so much optimism in the room about uh, Australia. Uh, everybody believes that with the upcoming federal election that uh, there will be a lot more stability in Australia and that uh, with a good strategy, good people, uh, then we will all succeed.